I'm doing an old school quick dinner today. Um, I cooked some dumplings yesterday, some spelt and rye dumplings, and um, I cooked extras on purpose because, okay, because I wanted to fry them off. I've got this thing. It's very old school. My grandmother used to do it. Uh, my mom used to do it. She doesn't do it as much, but my grandmother was definitely the one that I remember doing this. She went in when it came to this. Um, so what she used to do is boil dumplings and she'd cook whatever was left over the next day or fry it the next morning for breakfast and that's what I'm doing today it's not breakfast it is dinner the kids love it I love it it's easy it's simple and it's so much help as usual as usual I have to apologize I am in a rush I'm rushing I'm rushing I'm rushing I got about 15 minutes to cook this food so if you'd like to join me here we go and welcome back thank you for joining me again if you've been here before i'm glad you came back i'm happy to see you as much as you're happy to see me okay and here we are we're over the right side we eat here okay i didn't have that time to play today i put them in the fridge last night rinsed them off put them in the fridge and this is what they look like today we got a few dumplings right here just dumplings just dumplings y'all know what dumplings is i'm sure if you don't know it's literally dough salt water made together in a dough bro piece off and roll drop it in hot water let it boil drop it in soup drop it in a any kind of broth yeah and let them cook okay now i'm gonna fry these with some sweetheart cabbage some plantain some pear as i said part of my life planting a pear is a part of my life they'll never go anywhere so today we're gonna do that i'm gonna do that real quick when i say real quick i mean real quick we ain't got time man i got about 10 minutes to show y'all how to do this and show y'all what i've been eating and tell y'all why i'm so happy okay okay but yeah so we're just literally slicing these into like so and i'm just gonna pop them in the pan I'm going to cheat a little bit today. I've got some frozen sweet peppers and frozen onions. That is how fast I'm going. So, once we get, I'm going to put these two together and just fry some plantain and some pear. You can put any size with it. You can put some extra cauliflower, some broth. You can whatever size you want. It's a sweetheart cabbage for me. And, uh... I need that done real quick. Hi guys, welcome back. I'm just literally adding a quick, few quick seasonings. This is regular seasonings. A bit of smoked paprika, a little bit of onion powder, a bit of garlic powder, some cayenne pepper, some black pepper. I did put a little bit of pimento. You don't have to put that if you don't like really like pimento, but I love pimento. Um, just add to your taste and just remember it is cabbage, so or whatever greens you're using. So you don't want to put sea too salt, much of man, anything salt, in there. You kind of want to taste that. Well, I do anyway. But yeah, a um, little bit of tomato puree. Let that fry for about five minutes before you add your cabbage. All right, guys. Like, share. I'm going to put some tomato puree in there. Tiny bit of water. This is from the whole cabbage. And I don't want, I want it al dente. I don't want it to go mushy. I hate mushy cabbage. I can not stand mushy greens full stuff. I don't know why people make them mushy. We're going to just... Put a tiny bit of water in there and make sure all of that loveliness is 
back in. So we're just gonna put the cover on. I'm gonna turn it down really low. Five minutes. Because then it's near enough right there. I'm just gonna fry the plantain. I've got Bob is my uncle. <laughs> Could be your uncle. Could be who's ever uncle, man. Bob, somebody's uncle. I know that. Jeez, I'm crying. Don't forget the time. Jeez, I'm crying. I can't forget the time. What I'm gonna do because I forgot the time and I'm not leaving it on for long, I'm just gonna strip it all off and pop it in just to intensify that flavour, which I forgot to put in there. Can you tell I love my own company? Can you really, really tell? I can tell. I love my own company. So, um, I'm gonna literally turn these off. They've been on for five minutes. I'm gonna switch them off. I'm gonna leave them in the pan because when I come back, I'm just gonna switch it on, give it a little heat through. And we will be eating. So I will show you what we be eating when I get back. But I know this video is short. So guess what? Most of it's going to be me talking to you. Telling you why I'm so happy. I'm hoping you can tell. I'm hoping you can tell why I'm happy. Can you tell why I'm happy? Can you see that girl? Oh, is she nearly flat? Well, in my eyes. <laughs> Compared to what she looked like before. I look nine months pregnant, man. But yeah. Look, guys. Okay. Love y'all. I ain't gonna leave y'all and I'll be back with y'all. And I'm back, the food is ready. I will okay. Should I bring you on my shirt? Should I should I? Hold on a second. Um I'm gonna do this. That's my greens, my pears. I said it's nothing nothing bougie. And my plantain, because the pear and plantain is alive. And these are the dumplings. There's two extra pieces of plantain that I was left over. And what I do. What I do is I get a, I get a dumpling. We load it up with greens. Do you know what you're missing? You don't try this. Do you know what you mean? Mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> if the kids ever saw me, let's remember these dumplings are made of spelt and rye. Bad me, bad. Guys, I'm not gonna lie This literally took me ten minutes. As long as the dumplings are already boiled, I'm literally cooking cabbage, fried the dumpling, frying the plantain, cutting some pear. If you don't love avocado, and you don't love plantain, find some other sides. If you don't love cabbage, sweetheart cabbage, everybody, everybody's gotta love sweetheart cabbage. But if you don't love sweetheart cabbage, Find more. So I find some greens that you do like. What well, you know? What you love? I love kale. I love every greens. I love kale, cabbage, callaloo. The whole of them come. Not now. We just not now. That's where. You understand? Mm, I some love them. So yeah, guys. This is a uh, a quick video. Show you what I've been eating. How I've been doing. <laughs> and I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I hope you're doing good too. Because I love me some me and I gotta love me some me because if I don't love me, I can't love nobody else And I got some love to give. That's why I know I love me some me because I got lots of love to give, baby I'm trying to share some with you. I hope you share some with me Because you know what? Love makes the world go round, baby. Oh, yes, it does And good food <laughs> Okay, guys, so like, share, subscribe and come back and holler at you girl because I'm telling you I'm telling you I've got you lot back like that got you got mine you know what I mean sub a seat I'll see if so we do it hey <laughs> all right but yeah anyway like share subscribe and holler at you girl see y'all later enjoy your day karma's a beautiful thing that's why I love her